welcome to our DeLille Family Homestead YouTube channel. As you can see, I am not a full-time homesteader yet. I am a school teacher. You can see the music posters behind me. I teach music, art, and gym for kindergarten only. We call it Integrated Arts, and I am in Matawan, Michigan. Hopefully you enjoy our journey as we start our first true homestead in Pawpaw. We came from a small ranch in a cul-de-sac near Matawan in Lawton, Michigan. We outgrew that pretty quickly and now here we are in Pawpaw. We'll start by showing you our old homestead and then of course our new one. Enjoy. Don't forget to like and comment on our video and hope to have more very soon. To our first, I guess you could call it homestead. Here's our big garden out back. Charlie's Treehouse. A little bittersweet. This is the last day we have occupancy. It's a subdivision house on one acre. We've used all the acreage. A little barn with chickens. They've been moved to the new seven and a half acre homestead. Bittersweet, but we've definitely it's eight acres. outgrown this place. We're here to grab the rest of mom's perennials from the garden she dug up. We already got our blueberry bushes, asparagus, rhubarb, horseradish, raspberry, grapes. Yummy stuff. So, this is it. Goodbye. Just pulling into the new homestead on Pawpaw Road. Outside this morning, just getting a few tasks done. There's the barn we're pretty excited about. Chicken coop. It's kind of a mess right now. Boxes are everywhere. All right, guys, here's the barn. And um, the barn, I got, Dad said he needs his phone back, so I gotta show you, okay. And there's the upstairs. I'm gonna walk up there real quick and also show you. I'm walking up the barn. I'm almost up. Now I'm up. Here's the off of the barn. There's a lot of crap, so gotta be careful, Ben. I wanna get all dirty. I just took a bath. Who gets dirty after they take a bath? Fix our tiller. The tiller goes on the back of my little John Deere. It broke. Second time tilling up my garden for the fall. So we got to get it looked at. Tiller, it's my first time pulling that tractor off the ramps. I was a little nervous. my farm hand, Charlie. understand what was wrong with it. They told me that it was some bolts or something with the tines. The tiller wouldn't touch the ground all of a sudden when I was tilling after I hit a rock on a turn. Now it touches the ground. I don't see how that fixes. I hope it doesn't happen again because I don't know how to fix it. Our old neighbor has got an old work site outhouse. And we're going to harvest it to either use as a deer blind or a little garden tool shed.
Betsy's giving us some good milk tonight. Rich in buttercream. Yeah. Milking once a day in the evening, getting over two gallons. Oh, there's Charlie riding his go kart out there. No, but what Betsy's eating? Oh, she's she's eating hay. She's and cracked corn. She's eating hay with sweet mix and cat corn. There it is. So well behaved though. And, they the, and there is Betsy. She's nine years old. She's nine years old. I thought they said she's almost ten. She has to be ten by now. I don't think so. I thought they said nine. But they said she's almost ten. Are you still 10. taping? Oh no, that's leaking. What's leaking? Milk. That's okay. Um, in here. Dad cut her um, tail. Because she was swishing it and it was getting on the ground. It was this, by the milk. This is where our pee and poop come out. Okay. <laughs> and then, and then this is... Don't swing the camera all around. you got to be a good videographer. You'll and make then, everybody see shit. And then here is the brush that we brush that she with. So I will brush her with this brush. So all you do, just brush her. Good bit. He's so excited. <laughs> did you do yeah. your own finger Oh, he's nails. clean looking though. Like a... Now, did you show I him or just bring him? Aww. We didn't end up even taking him yet. Oh, you didn't? Oh, okay. Oh, man, we just washed him. Yeah, <laughs> He needs a diaper, doesn't he, Grace? Yeah. He's all yucky. I'm not sure how they were dead set on taking the other one and showing him, so. Oh, you didn't go? We took. Oh, you did go. Okay. Gear, gotcha. Look out, Grace, because he might be a little wild. Come on. Come on, buddy. <laughs> There's your steery weary. Yep. You want him? Yeah. <laughs> Are you sure? Don't let go of the rope. Just to make sure. Oops. He's gonna take some training. He's yeah, not Betsy. I he might He's not Betsy. Around. She's He's interested definitely. what's going on though. <laughs> Why don't you open that gate, Charlie? Dad, are you sure Betsy's gonna be nice <laughs> I think she'll be fine. She might like having something in I figured. I know they like to have two, is what I was told, that they eat better. Oh, I didn't think about that. I just thought about that. You think she'd... I wonder if she'd let him. Betsy's poopy! I see that. It's pretty soupy, isn't it? Yeah, she might not. She's so used to... Not used to all this. Well, she had pasture, I think. Poopy again. Yeah, I think the... Harry poop, too. Charlie says he's... You're going to step in it. Charlie says he's calling him Harry. <laughs> Is that what the name was already? Yeah. Okay, so I don't, couldn't remember. <laughs> She's checking it out. She, checking him out. She wonders what's going on. He went right, so we'll go lay down. I think. Let us in, bud. Can we come in? Oh, okay. Yes. She got those shoes from Maddie, our neighbor. But now we move. And we got a big farm. And we got a chicken coop. We got a, uh, this is, that right there is where she sleeps. And that's where she gets her food, down there in that white yeah. And there's Gracie. She's in now. I'm videotaping. There's mom. Putting in some fencing today. Wife wasn't real happy when she found out that I spent over $1,000 in fencing. We're just getting started here. I'll show you the final product next time. Worried about chickens and deer. Last night there were four in the yard eating crab out. We got two of these and then another quart today. I still had a little to toss. Wish I had some pigs to feed the excess to. Thanks, Betsy. Here's where we're keeping our freezer milk. It's filling up pretty quick. But finally, the piggies are just starting to drink some milk. Eat some milk, as you can see. Fresh raw milk straight out of Betsy. 
Kate, you won't try it? No. Ooh, it's good. Pour me some. You like it? Hi. I'm in the chicken coop, guys. I got white chicken. A whole new chicken coop. And we got baby dog. Watch a girl, watch a boy. We got little you know, chicks and ducks and chickens in there, but they're still little. And we got a bunch. And there's where they lay their eggs in here. And there the chicken's food. And the um, food is in there. And the big chickens eat them, so we gotta keep it close. We're gonna butcher these um, these white things. There's three of them. And the other one's somewhere. And they, we butcher them because they're getting really fat and we eat them. Dad just cuts the neck right off. And we got three of these. Um, that's, um, that's yellow. That, there's, there's some more of those. And that's gonna, um, be into a chicken. Sorry, sounds like a chicken. Ha <laughs> ha! And there's chickens up there that can go. There's a bunch of wood and this is the chicken area. And, and they're, um, home, um, they're free range. Does anyone know what free range is? That means that you can... It can come out in this. As you can see, I'm finding eggs in the darndest of places. That is not a nesting box, Miss White Leg Horn. It's on video. This is the little guy. Feel always a little bad doing this, but it is what it is, I guess. If you want to eat meat, he's out of pain now. clip because the big one was too big I had to wrap it through the chain and then the smaller one is kind of too small it's just his nerves going I don't know if they'll let me have that on YouTube whacking his head off these are peats I can't get it out we just set up the, mold, the little butcher station, so it's taken us a long time this first time as we figure everything out for how to do it here. There we go. This one's legs are skinnier because it's smaller. That'll never work for a turkey. I'll just have to wrap it around like that and pin it off, which is fine. This one's got smaller legs. That last one was a rooster, and each one, you see it drops right through. They're all different size big time. I don't think it'll hold at all. Will it? Or is it gonna hold like that maybe? For now, until it doesn't. And you just start pulling feathers. Realized after we started we needed to have the wheelbarrow under so we don't have to pick everything up twice. We're real smart. It takes us a minute. There's Betsy. Alright. Here's where they're getting their ice bath. Ice already melted. We'll finish plucking them. This one I think right here is the rooster, and uh, that one's the head I think. That one up there is the head again too. Just changing the oil, doing some mundane tasks. Mom doesn't like it because it's dirty and messy and she has to wait, but she saves money. She doesn't like spending money. Do you have a lot in savings because of this? Fifty dollars maybe? The COVID thing, we gotta wear these masks, huh? <laughs> Had to get a door because we just bought a new house in the master bedroom. Or the homestead doesn't have a door. Oh my gosh, I bought the 30 inch door. Way too small. So I took the trim pieces out. Had to, now this 32 inch door is too big. But it's the right size for most of it, but nothing's square in this old house. Finally got the door kind of sort of finished. I the big one. It even almost closes. I the big one. Anyway. There's more. Oh, I don't want to close. Go back to it. Stay up. Come on. Okay. 
Which one do we want, Gra Charlie? Which one do you want, Grace? I want that one. The pink one with the black spots on his back? You want this one right here, don't you? Or that one with the black spots? Bring that one here. Yeah. Grab him. He doesn't like that, does he? <laughs> That's called bacon seeds. All right, which one else do you want? Look at him. Don't you want a pink one? Like Wilbur? Yeah. Get that black and white one too right there. Yeah. Grab him on his back leg. Oh, Grab him on his back leg, he said. Back leg. Right there you go. He can't hurt you now, he's too small. <laughs> Alright, then get that black and white one too. Yeah. They're yeah. trying to get away from Charlie, aren't they, Grace? Whoa, Grab. Look how he's holding them, Grace. Back leg. That's funny. Back leg, bud. There you go. Will they be okay in the back of the truck or should we put them in the truck? Whoa. What's going on with him? That one you can't have. You've got a problem. Something going on? Get it, yeah. Get a different one. Uh, should we get it? Get any one in there. I don't care. Come on. That's hard, man. Grab the back leg, he said. Uh, Another pink one. Don't drop him down, hurt him. Why don't you get another barrel? Then they won't be coming and eat the riding there. So get one. Boys, you said? Yeah. Barrows are called Barrows. when they're young, right? Yep. Or when they're castrated. Yep. There's the piggies at home, I guess, making friends with the chickens. Go grab one, Charlie. Okay. <laughs> See if they're getting braver. They're still pretty skittish. Grab one and we'll see how they're doing. We got who are you grabbing? Which one? They seem to like the run better than the, the piggies do at this point. There's our little bacon seeds. Grab the leg, remember? That's what Farmer Phil said. Yeah. One second. They're having their breakfast out there this morning. Farmer Charlie's not much of a pork farmer. He can't grab a piggy. Okay. Oh, he got out. See, that's what I was worried about. We need to get... Don't hurt him. We need to get... Hold him nice now. See how feel how he feels. Does he feel like he's gonna be good bacon? Oh yeah, good. Uh, we're with the steers right now. They're, they're eating breakfast. Uh, hope you like this video. Enjoy it, and please make sure to like and subscribe, and look for more videos at the Little Acre Homestead.